just a couple of, just not enough feel of the game there. Anyway, in the meantime, Hind runs his full measure to the top of the square. Big fly. This time he's got it. They won't take it off him. That's a ripper from Jones. The Hawks are on the run now. Wingard inside 50 with the kick. Big mark required this time off the hands of the pack. Cousins gets it down. The kick comes in from O'Brien. It was a beauty. And the Hawks will have their first set shot at goal. Just starting to find the footy now. His fourth disposal. It's a good-looking kick. Langford has been able to kick goals up forward by taking marks this year every now and then. He's got a free kick on this occasion. So after a slow opening, the goals are starting to flow. Langford puts through Essendon's second goal. Yeah, the ball comes out the scrim short. Whoops, just fumbled and it's on. Here goes Jake Stringer, the excitement machine. Will he go off the deck? He does, he wants the goal. He's been watching the Euros. He scores. It's into the back of the onion bag. Goal to Stringer. Hind knocks it forward. Picked up by Heppel. Smothered. Picked up by Moore. Good play out to Mitchell. Around the body it goes. And Mitchell scores a beautiful goal on the left foot. Bramble wearing Isaac Smith's old number 16. Kicks to half forward. Wingard dumps it quickly. Oh, flicks it forward to Bruce. Oh, it's like low hanging fruit for Luke Bruce. Bang it through. Hawks getting right on top in the second term. Nipple aware of that. Tosses it up. McDonald's tip and Woody was flying. Stringer. He's got it. He has put the Bombers back in front, and that could change everything. Up towards McAvoy. Good play by Heppel to jump into the hole. Wingard's handball was pretty good as well. To Bramble, the first gamer. Oh, that's a good mark from Kaczynski. That is a really good mark. Yeah, great hands. Kaczynski comes in. Bends it, bends it, bends it, and puts it through. Beautiful execution of the banana from the boundary line. By Impey to create that, that transition play for Hawthorne as well. Bombers on the fly again. Parrish had to come to a standstill just to win it, but he's delivered it to Smith. Now he can touch the ground. And as a result, a rush kick forward. Carl's going to win it. Carl is going to score! So Segler gets the tap. Hine picks it up and the Bombers can run it out. He loves to bounce the footy and run and charge. Sometimes he's not sure what's next. He's had five bounces, if you don't mind. And then kicks short to the wing to the favour of Jar. McAvoy and Draper. McAvoy taps it to no one in particular. Newcomb was down there, picked up by Shields, just slams it on the boot. It's great football. And O'Brien comes up and takes a telling mark. Now he thumps it long up towards the goal square. Zerk Thatcher gets back off hands. It's going to be a goal to Kaczynski. Kaczynski kicks the goal and Hawthorne hits the front. Five the bright one. lights. 5 1 centre bounce clearances for the Bombers. Make it 6 1 because it goes backwards to go forward and Hind does it beautifully. To Parrish, he just ran to the open side, positioning himself beautifully. In comes Merritt, gets the handball going. Hind keeps going, has a bounce from 50 metres out! Goal! What a goal! The ball is out of the centre, go to halfback, straight down the middle of the ground, and it's a goal, back-to-back -back goals to the Bombers. Seven points of difference. They challenge him out of the centre bounce. The ability to get forward. Oh, Ridley's kick is intercepted by Liam Shields. Keeping tabs on Zach Merritt for a lot of the game. But right now, it is a sure foot from 48 metres out. And it looks good all the way. An effort to touch on the line. I think just going to check this. 35 metres out, as you can see, directly in front of the Essendon goal. Segler just gets a hand on, picked up by Stringer, one-handed, on the right boot, Jake Stringer, you absolute superstar, what a goal!
McAvoy flies off hands, picked up by Draper. Good play, just thumps it long. Archie Fenno, except the big fella there in Jones. Harry Jones, 40 metres out, 45 degree angle. And kicks truly and puts it right through the middle of the bombers to kick the last two goals. Hit the kick at the beyond him in terms of scoring oh, himself. Oh, he slipped over. Slippery turf, Bruce captured. Mitchell thought about giving in the end. He had to. Coughed it up momentarily. Bruce, the danger was in it. Oh, that's sick. Push right. in the back. Oh, it's a push in the back. It's a push in the push back. In the back. Relatively quiet day, just the eight disposals, hasn't hit the scoreboard. Oh, he has now! Two minutes, 25 left, and there's only one goal between them. They dive in on top of it, hands grabbed, thrown to the ground. Carl does it well, Perkins flicks it out to Devin Smith, gets the right bounce, he points it over the top. Here we go, McDonald tip and one A! Goal, Guelphy! Great play, Bombers! An awful lot's going to have to go right for them now. 55 seconds. O'Meara, it's Parrish! He's been a star for them this year! And he gets them over the line! Bombers are home now! Heppel, the captain. How appropriate if he had it. Tip and Woody, Mitchell, Siren, and the Bombers win a famous game. It's been a long time since they've been in Tasmania, but the Tasmanian Bombers have come out in numbers tonight to see their team keep their finals hopes alive.